We didn't have the biggest crew. Our funds were limited, but we used what we had to the best of our ability. You know, as an up and coming director, I'm extremely proud of the cast because they've all put their heart into this. And I'm very excited for the audience to see it and to come to the premiere because this is a stepping stone for Orange Lion Studios. Malik started to make this film and he had contacted me saying that he wants me to play this character. I said, I'm in. It felt like a family all getting together, just on set, ready to film. Everybody was really willing to give their all, and I think that was possible because of the director, Malik. What attracted me to the project is that it's the director's first big movie. I really wanted to be a part of it because I, I really believe in him. You know, I think it's like the beginning of the future for Orange Lion Studios. I remember how can this young director be so talented? When I heard that it was gonna be a full movie, I just really wanted to be a part of it. Shadows of Betrayal, Chronicles of Ian Blair is an action thriller film. The narrative takes place in Cypher City where you get to go on this journey with Ian Blair and his dog Bear as he's been running from the Cypher City authorities for the last four years from being accused of killing his wife, Rachel Blair. My name is Nick York and I play the character Jax McCoy. I spent six years in the military. I did uh, hands-on training with the United States Marine Corps. I spent a lot of time doing combat training simulations. And so being able to put that into a character like Jax McCoy, I was able to get into the character. I will find you! What attracted me was the character. I loved playing him. It was very exciting and just, it just spoke out to me. I can't wait till you guys check out this film. You'll see what I'm talking about. This one, we definitely got to have our fair share of fun with props. It didn't really feel like we were filming on set. It felt like we were recreating something that had already happened, just a reenactment. Ian Blair, played by Malik, played the main character, directed. He's getting into the trenches and he's learning every part of you know making films. I'm so excited to see the final product. It's been a great experience, uh, and to see the growth where uh, Orange Line Studios is going is really exciting. I feel like it's going to be a good time to kind of see everything, all of our, our labors put to fruition on that big screen. It's not just about Ian Blair and his chronicle. It's about the team's tenacity and their passion to continue going forward with this film and helping bring this vision to life. And it's been nothing but amazing. I've truly had an amazing experience with this. I'm looking forward to seeing all of you guys there at the film premiere on November 11th. November 11th. On November 11th. On November 11th for the film premiere.